everything in front of the A post on the driver's side is to say the least probably a bit of a disaster. The A post itself um, has got corrosion on the bottom and uh, the lower hinge is uh, non-existent, it's all rotted away. The damage goes right down the A post or right up the A post to where the windscreen mounts and there's corrosion around there so I'm going to have to take off the outer skin and have a look to see what's in there before I decide exactly how I'm going to tackle it. Moving forward into the footwell you can see that there's a, a lot of corrosion and a panel that's been welded over the top of the rust so that's all got to come out of the new footwell fitted or a new panel fitted. Uh, moving on to the inner wheel arch uh, there's corrosion all on the outer and the top of the wheel arch but there's a lot more inside where the webs are. Uh, the inner and the outer web are both rotted away and there's a makeshift repair being done to uh, this part of it. So what I intend to do here is I'm going to cut the whole of the front wing off and uh, buy a new panel complete and weld it on. Now while I've got that panel off I'm going to repair by making a new panel for the front of the footwell because there are numerous patches on that so that'll tidy all that up. Looking at the floor again lots and lots of uh, patches so simplest solution I think is to cut the whole of the front floor out. It extends back to about here and then I'll be able to fit a new floor panel and then moving back once I've got both the floors the new front floor panel and new rear floor panel I shall cut out the edge between and weld a new piece in so I've got something good to weld the uh, inner sill to. Obviously once all that's done it'll be a new inner new outer sill and oh, that'll be it job done. So I've removed the uh, front floor and uh, I've also removed the inner wing and you can see now the, the extent of the damage that was between the inner and outer web on the front panel. Also the kickboard has got a lot of rust on it so I intend to change that as well. So the next thing I'm going to do is take off the uh, outer sill so I can get a little bit more access and to cut this front point from just in front of the A post. It's not held by on by a lot. There's a lot of rust, a couple of spot welds so that'll come off rather easily. And I'm also going to remove the bottom section of the front panel. I'm going to cut it across here and uh, make a new piece and put it in and while I'm doing that I'll be taking out the uh, remains of the tow board. Okay when I've done all that I'll uh, do another video. I've uh, taken the outer sill off not that it took much doing because you can probably see and it was held on with just four spot welds who weren't very good ones uh, and a load of spot welds along here to what was left of the rusty inner sill. This has been uh, typical of all the repairs that I've found on this car. You can see it's just panel on top of panel on top of panel and here in actual fact there's one, two, three four pieces of metal all being welded one on top of the other. None of the rust has been taken out. So just thought I'd show you that uh, just to uh, give you an idea of what the car was like.